Good morning, good morning. Huck here, coming to you on day 100 of the Pacific Crest Trail. And man, I couldn't be happier. Just a little over halfway. Uh, not even out of California yet, but we're getting closer to that border to Oregon and two states left. Uh, should probably finish up around say two months or so, give or take a week. Definitely not give, uh, hopefully two months or less. We'll go with that, but stoked for it. So through these past few weeks, once we got out of the Sierras, just been getting immersed in this green tunnel here en route to Oregon. Lost quite a bit of elevation. I did get some really good conditioning up in the Sierras that constantly going up and down above 10,000 feet. But now we're just constantly going up and down between two and seven. So a little better. My lungs are happy. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling strong. Let's do the damn thing, baby. Man. Sure is a different kind of view up here. Man, it's beautiful up here. Starting to come out of a lot of those pines and get mixed in a lot more of these Douglas firs and red firs, a lot more oaks. So the plan for the day is to just push on and bust out that cruisy 30 mile day. <sighs> Got probably another 13 miles of uphill. Hooray, stoked, looking forward to it. Gonna be awesome. So I woke up at about five this morning and got everything ready, started moving. Uh, just try and get a few miles in before that heat sets in because it's 645 now and I'm already dripping sweat but I'm at about mile 1512 or so and got about 26 miles left of the day Seems like the worst is over. I'm about 15 miles in or so, and you can kind of see the trail where it just kind of wraps around and looks like we bumped through that saddle. And go check out the other side. What a day. Whew. So at this point, it seems like the rest of today and tomorrow is just gonna be following along a reasonable elevation along these ridge tops. Just headed north. Doesn't seem to have too much elevation change over that course, so hopefully it'll be pretty mellow and just get views like this all day. But we'll see. Just walking along this ridge. This is the other side. It's uh, Mount Less, or not Less, and uh, Mount Shasta right there. What a day. And 
another epic view. Look at that volcano. Got a real nice view of Shasta from here. Look at that. So, we are somewhere around 26, 27 miles for the day. Just gonna go over this ridge over here and start working my way down and camp at the next water source. Man, it has been a beautiful day. I'm in no rush. Just take your time. You going to Canada too? Hey, uh, trails this way. Dang. Nature. So, coming to you at 7 10 p.m. And I should be closing in on that last mile of the day, which will put me at 30 miles. <sighs> Not too bad. Made it to camp. Just went for a nice little dip. Took a bath. Setting up the tent. We got old Hiccup and Honey Puff out there bathing up. <sighs> Good morning. Coming to you on day 101. Woke up at that lake this morning. Birds chirping. No mosquitoes. Waters are flowing. It's gonna be a good day. Gonna go and crush out this cruisy 30 mile day. Uh, it's gonna be a bit more leveled out than yesterday, so looking forward to that. Um, yeah, 30 miles today, 30 miles tomorrow, and an easy morning into town on Thursday. Let's do this. And, uh, last night, I was watching a little bit of lightning off in the distance. Had to be five or six miles away. But I'm starting to smell a little smoke. And I hope that there's not a fire up ahead of me. You can see back that way, it does look pretty smoky. But I'm gonna hope for the best and keep on pushing. Looking a little hazy back there. Still a pretty day. All right, day 102. <laughs> Say hey, Hiccup. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> what a morning. It's looking a bit smoky back there. 
going for that 30 mile day. It's a beautiful morning. A bit more up and down today. Bring it on. So I just had a little break with uh, Hiccup and her brother Honeypuff, who I've been hiking with for a few weeks. And uh, since we're gonna make it to town tomorrow, we decided to just make it an easier day and take a cruisy 26, 27 mile day and just uh, hammer out the last six miles or so in the morning and make it to Edna. California and yeah so that'll be awesome make it a little bit more enjoyable take it nice and slow but look at all this moss how sweet is that the whole forest is just fluorescent sweet Northern California, everybody. As soon as I came over that saddle, everything seems to be burnt in this general area at least. Day 103, coming up on mile 1600. That puts me just a little over a thousand miles left of the entire Pacific Crest Trail. I'm getting there. Look at this morning. Got a late start. Just heading out of camp now at about 7.15. Uh, just gonna knock out a cruisy seven miles. I ended up doing 28 miles yesterday. Uh, just gonna do, oh, actually it's 5.7 miles until I make it to the road where I'll hitch into Etna, take a zero and recuperate. I've got some gnarly rashes on the hips from my waist belt. Oh man, look at that. Whoo! Yeah, buddy.
Yeah, buddy. <laughs>